I mean, as easy as he's broke. Okay, you guys, that was still $200 now. That's not <laughs> you just poured water down the speaker, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I have never seen an umbrella do anything like that. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome to Dope or Nope, the channel on YouTube that rates products dope or no. That's right guys, Matthias here, sleepy boy. So we're gonna make fun of him this whole episode, but today we are looking at 10 products that prove the future is here. Michael, give me one clap. Here. Today's video, we have a wonderful, awesome sponsor, and that is Oculus. We are going to be looking at the Quest later in this video, but if you guys wanna see more information right now, check out the link in the description down below. It's the top link, make sure you guys look at it. It's sick. Like Matt. I added some Tai Chi in it later. I mean, before. <laughs> <laughs> There's a Tai Chi game. Really? Yeah. I'm not I don't know what that means. Is that a type of noodle? Sounds like it. <laughs> Let's get into that first product. Board up, nerds. Check out the portable skateboard mini longboard. Mini longboard? What the fuck? It's a board. <laughs> mini skateboard longboard. Dude, mini. you know what a mini longboard is? Just a regular skateboard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay. I, I see where we're going here. You got a hinge right in the middle of it. I mean, square. if it fits in your backpack, that's pretty tight. You can make triangles if you want, practice geometry. Go back to the second image. Throw a picture of Michael by the board. Stop! <laughs> hey, throw, throw, a picture of, throw a picture of me like right here. Uh, it just says 17 inches tall. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, this dude's whipping Whoa, it right yeah, now. He's... Whoa, was she wearing oh. boots? Was she wearing boots? She boarded up, dog. I want to see you guys do that little move where you like, you, like lift it up it and to... you take it without bending over. I don't want to see you guys bend over. But I kind of also want to take this to CJ to see how durable the middle of it is. And if you can kickflip it. Like kickflip? <laughs> or yeah. <laughs> it just flips on him, breaks his ankles. <laughs> I'm calling it. All right, well, let's hope he called wrong, because that's his employee. <laughs> okay, I had the cart. If you're happy you know it, check out this. That was really bad, I'm sorry, everybody. This is the folding longboard, so you can carry it. It has a little handle. Oh yeah, we came to CJ, like I told you guys. He didn't just stumble in a frame. Because he's a skating pro. You hold it via the fingertips. Carry it anywhere you want with you, and then out of nowhere, Locked into place. It's kind of dope. Drop it, look at that, rubber boy. Yeah, and then you pop it, and then look at that. Ooh, that's dope. That's tight. You wanna leave it a ride to see if it's a good skateboard? You can go yeah. up back. Let's go see, come on. Yeah. All right, CJ, pop it and lock it. Let's see you ride this this guy. You snapped that thing into place like my heart. Feels good. Kick flip it. I told him I'd let you try and kick flip it. <laughs> Robert, edit it like he, he landed it and kick flipped it. Oh, dude. The devil high five. What do you think? Is it a dope or no? It's kind of dope. I don't know, I'm split. Like it's dope, but really is awkward, but it's cool. Yeah, let me see. The feature is cool. The feature of being able to carry it, that's cool because skate knowledge, you don't look cool when you hold your skateboard by the truck. Like if you're walking and you're holding your skateboard like this, that's not cool. So it is kind of cool that you have like a handle built into it. I say it's a dope. Anything you exercise on, it's a dope. Tanner? Tanner's gone, next product. Wow. Wow, this is sleek. Oculus Questoru. It's even like dope or nope colors, bro. I honestly love the packaging. Packaging's beautiful. It reminds Simple. me of myself. Full disclaimer, before Oculus even sponsored us, I have two of these things. I mean, or excuse me, Amanda has one, I have one. Joey has like three or four. Yeah. Joey has three? Joey has like three or four. So like when people go to his house, oh, like, he can like it's play just with a quick them. setup. They just yeah. get in there and play, dude. It's crazy. So if you look inside this box, it literally only comes with this stuff, right? It comes with, well, we don't have it in here, but the, the charger is only here. We've been using <laughs> <laughs> it to charge it. Uh, but it also comes with literally just a headset and then remotes, right? Most VR stuff usually has wires and all these crazy things. Oh this. gosh, so many wires. So what you gotta do is pop them on your wrist real quick. Slide these puppies up, cause safety first, kids. That's right. Any kids that aren't safe, you're not cool. Pop these in your hands, right? Other way. <laughs> Sorry. Cool, so let's take a look at the headset really quick, guys. It's got two eyes, looks like Wally. We have the power button right here. This is the only button you need to power it on, which is super sickness. I say I pop it on right now. Or Michael, Michael, do you wanna do it or do you want me to do it? I'll have you do it. Okay, good, because I wasn't going to let you anyways. So <laughs> I'm going to pop it on right now, take off my glasses that are totally prescription, by the way. You don't need to. I mean, they have settings for glasses, too. Really? Full clarity, but these are fake glasses. Does that hurt your eyes? Even? <laughs> <laughs> so it doesn't matter. He just added the blue light right back in. I think Tanner, like, <laughs> even spent, like, a good dollar on those. <laughs> he just chuck them. Basically, what Tanner's doing right now is he's setting up, like, the guardian zone. It's pretty sick because the sensors will basically track everything around you in real time, so you don't need lighthouses. You don't need, like, being hooked up to an external computer. It's pretty sick, right? So it'll also track the controllers. And so what Tanner's doing right now is he's drawing a little zone around him, which when he finishes, it basically puts up this grid wall and then puts him into virtual reality. What's amazing is if he steps out, it will alert him. And if you leave this area, literally the cameras will turn on. You'll be able to actually walk around and see the outside, the real world, essentially for, you know, all the regular 
people. Heck yeah. <laughs> this is what the home screen looks like, guys. So this is kind of like my little cabin in the woods. Has a fireplace, has a writing desk. Matt loves that section. And then, um, <laughs> yeah, it kind of just feels super homey, super yeah. warm. Yeah, and so we're gonna play some games. Like, I think today we're gonna play Vader Immortal, and this is one of our favorites to play. So this is Vader Immortal 1. There's two versions of Vader Immortal. I've actually beaten the first one, so I'm gonna let Tanner play it here. It's awesome. Right? <gasps> Woo! He got a lightsaber. What's up, nerd? Can I deflect with my lightsaber too? Oh yeah, you better deflect or you're gonna die. We went to the wrong neighborhood, bro. <laughs> they call me Luke Tanwalker, bro. They're not behind me. All right, we're good. Dude, this is like playing baseball. <laughs> what are these little, little droids flying if you're in a Stop, one. dude. So what's really awesome about this is that this is like one of the AAA games. Obviously, there's two Vader Immortals. There's some other amazing games. For instance, Dead and Buried. My, me and my brother played with a bunch of guys when we got over to our house. That was a blast. That game's it's, a It's one. basically like a first-person shooter, but you're like running around, like just destroying each other. There's also Super Hot. That's a super popular game as well. In Super Hot, in the quest, you literally literally have to dodge things IRL, right? Like you literally have to move your body to dodge things. It's like more interactive. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. But yeah, look, like, you know, look at all the setup. This is all it takes. Normally you'd be expecting, I need a giant computer. I need things hooking up to my walls. I need my dad's supervision. You probably should still get your dad's supervision. But I'm just saying, this is super <laughs> he easy. He had to make sure he was by the couch for a second. <laughs> he was like. Dude, it's, it's kind of boring out here now. <laughs> yeah. So I definitely would say guys that this is a dopey McDoperson. Yeah, yeah, this is safe. It's for sure dope. Absolutely. If you guys want to go take a look at this and possibly get one for yourselves, check out the link in the description down below. And then you guys can party hard just like us over here at Dope or Nope. And, you know, maybe send me some videos. You guys shaking those hips. Tweet them to us, yo. At high five, Dope or Nope. All right. Do it. Let's take a look at that next product. All right, guys. This next product, baby, it's a like to buy. It is a Segway 9 bot electric These are cool. go kart. I mean, just look at this thing. It's, <laughs> first of all, it's $800. And this baby looks <laughs> spicy. Michael is the worst salesman. Th there should be some storm troopers driving out on this. Just look, look at, it. at it, dude. Look how sick this looks. With dude. your eyes. Do you know how this works, Michael? Yeah, you have to have a nine bot. So pretty much you buy the body frame. So you buy just this. And then if you have a nine bot, then you can connect it to the back. And remember I got a nine bot, right? I have one. Why well, didn't I put this in here, baby? That's what I'm talking about. Because we can dog. combine the two. Nine bot. Go See? Card. See? That kid you should not be riding it, one. Boom. Strap it in. Okay, hold on. That's if you that's ever high five your dad like that, that, you're a liar. I think that's just a little projection, Tanner. Um, I don't know. Look yeah. at that. <laughs> that's not projection. Maybe that's, that's some things you missed out no, on your I, childhood. No, I high five Luna like Devil that. Devil high five. Look at this. First off, this is so dangerous. I just had a safety meeting. And I'm just saying, <laughs> look at them racing next to these giant things that could fall nice. on them. See? What sick. if you went too far that time? Bye. Oh, oh, you can, what? Sicko mode. Oh, I want this even more now. You can drift? All right, so if you guys want to see us buy this, all right, and get Matthias's nine bot that he has, combine the two and race this baby around the studio, I'm going to say 200K likes. Hear me out. Because it's if you $800. See, if you want to see him high five Luna like that weird dad and son did, that's 210,000 likes. And he'll give him this weird, like, slow motion. I'm not going to do it because it's weird, but it'd be <laughs> like that. It's such like an endearing thing to do with your kid. It's weird. Next product, comment down below. Tanner's just jealous. High five, dad. Comment down below, Oculus. Next product. Ha ha ha, funny joke, or is it? We got a prank pack. <laughs> We got a prank pack, you guys, that can let you shower and brew coffee at the same exact time. Thanks, Michael. That was really nice of you to help me out yeah, with that. Yeah, you were struggling. Now, if what Tanner, this product I swear, is... Tanner, if you mention the orange again, I'm gonna lose it. Fun fact, I'm gonna mention the orange again. If you guys don't eat oranges in the shower, you're losing your life. You guys need to take an orange Wait, into the shower, eat it up, and then eat it. It is the best experience of all time. You should do that. And while you're in there, you already got breakfast, maybe get yourself a hot cup of joe. And I'm not talking about the guy. So yeah, pretty much this is an actual prank box. Oh, Boo! they used the prank box. Oh no, somebody, no, we're gonna actually make this product, okay? Yeah. We have engineers on set, known as Chanel and Liz. All right. Add it to cart. Michael, I will, you aggressive son of a gun. Add to cart. Dude, this looks legit. <laughs> it looks pretty close, right? So just imagine you got this baby in your shower. So here's Tanner in the shower. Where's your orange? Oh, here it is. <laughs> 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 Where's your orange? <laughs> Dude, hear me out. Power it's play. Like water, Robert. You brew it and then it showers you with the brew. Ooh. Ooh. New meaning to coffee enema. Whoa. Anim, what? You don't know what a coffee enema is? Enemas are my enemy, you do. bro. You probably heard of that. Dude, that's gonna be a hot plate, just to let you know. It does turn on. Yeah, it works. I would show just you guys no this water part. comes out. Shh. Guys, this totally works, but we just don't have any active water to make sure it works. But just trust us, because our engineers, Liz and Chanel, they're also plumbers. Real Mario and Luigi over there, working on things. This is pretty much it. Imagine this, just chilling where your soap dispenser would go. Just pop that out. 
Thank you, Robert. Sometimes we do bits just for the editors, everybody. Oh my gosh. I want you guys to comment. Is this a faithful representation of this box? If it is, comment down below. Yes, faithful? Tanner, good sir. Or no, Tanner. Accurate? Good, faithful. All right, guys, end that poll up there. Vote if you think this invention would be dope to have in the future or have now, so that way you can bathe and brew at the same time. All right, next product. We got a Presto Pizzazz pizza cooker. Look at it, it's a little rotating hot plate that just cooks your pizza and your wings and what are those, like potato? Can you say wing peels? again for me? Wings, your wangs, your pizza, your za. It's not cooking my wangs, it's cooking my wings. Your wangs, bro, your wangs. All right, it's no longer for sale. Yeah, so we couldn't find it from this store, but we found it yes. elsewhere. We elsewhere. have secured one. Is it a quesadilla maker too? This is a great question for Michael. <laughs> why do you bro? Maker You've too? used it. I've never used it before. That's why we bought it, so we can use it. Because you're Mexican. Because I'm brown, I know. No. You have something against being brown? No, I, it's me, it's my people. I can't change Link you. Link up, Scott. Si se puede. <laughs> si se puede. This kid tried to mess with <laughs> me. I tried to box you. <laughs> tried to box me in Spanish. Oh, that was cringy. I was like, I think I, I think I have that, dude. <laughs> That's a very bad. That's a very bad. All my ancestors are just so sad. <laughs> Turning over in the And that's brain. on the internet forever now, so. <laughs> All right, let's bring it out and make some za. I've been waiting for lunch for hours now. Wow, it turns. We have it on dual, so that way it heats all over the pan. And we're gonna set it to eight minutes. What is, oh, top and bottom, so it heats yeah, the pan so too. Underneath, yeah, the plate, there's like a little uh, hot plate, maybe you would say. Yeah, Wouldn't this that just this really hot. cook your food really slow? Is this just designed to- Or is just more of like a, you already cooked it and it's just to put it out at your keep party, warm, just to yeah. kind of keep it. Okay, let's try some, Michael. You want one? No, thank you. This is probably like the last thing he wants to eat while being sick, to be honest. Straight up. You don't want that part, bro? I stopped eating greasy food for like a week, and then like a week later, I just did, don't want it anymore. <laughs> this is pretty good. I can see it as a nice party tool, and I wonder if it can actually like cook something, maybe throw an egg on that. Yeah. Here's my question. Can you modify it to go really fast? Just like whip that baby? Yeah, exactly. So essentially, you know, someone comes up, let me get a slice, and you just like speed it up and it shoots a slice at them. Oh no, let me see. Whoa! I was gonna have Robert edit it, but I love your live action rendition. Yeah, I got you, bro. All right, my mouth rates it a dope. Yeah, I'm gonna say the product's honestly a nope, but I'll say the food's a dope. All right, next product. Windproof umbrella. The weather will never defeat you ever again when you've got this windproof umbrella. Its ergonomic design prevents it from becoming inverted. Even on the windiest days, yeah, many different colors available to suit all tastes. So this might actually be kind of helpful. I mean, we get crazy winds, but like not while it's raining, but in some areas where like the winds are crazy and your umbrella does like flip up. Let's take a pull. Let's it. take a poll. When's the last time, we'll go one by one, when's the last time you used an umbrella? That's what I just said. Here, it's not as relevant to us, but in like other parts of the world where it's like consistently raining on them, this could be helpful. Why don't they just move? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Seattle is not the place to live if you don't like rain, Michael. Add the info. Hey, this is my product. Is it bad luck to open this indoors? Asking for a friend. Oh, it looks like a bird. Wow. This looks like a blackbird. You know, like the, the SR-71. Okay, nerd. It just looks like a Dude, Dementor's rubbish. You just gave yourself seven years bad luck. It's like, <laughs> eat some salt. This is my parenting tactic. I have a kid, I'm just like, well, yeah? You're gonna do it again? Boom, seven years. <laughs> seven years of bad luck. <laughs> seven years of spankings. All right, Michael, you wanna go test this via some intense wind? Yeah, let's take it also out Also known as a leaf blower. All right, guys, we're out back of Orange Base, and so I got the umbrella here. <clears throat> Tan Man is coming with the leaf blower. We're gonna see how well this futuristic balloon will hold up. If it inverts. Balloon? Especially balloon? Yeah. How umbrella. will this umbrella hold up? If it inverts, it's a no-go. Come on, Tanner, put your Mike? back into it. You got it. Oh. Big one. Here, tip it down. Guys, this leaf blower sounds really intense, but it doesn't blow hard. It's like yeah, a Yorkie. It doesn't do anything. I could probably just do it myself. Ready? <laughs> So that was trash. Uh, I just did it myself. I have never seen an umbrella do anything like that. <laughs> look at the way it looks, dude. Even the little string. Like, I what? mean, hey. Fixed it. But it doesn't do what it said. It said it's supposed to be wind resistant. Yo, Michael, show them Instagram and then show them versus reality. Instagram, reality. <laughs> just like crying. He was like. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, this leaf blower sucks more than it blows. It's trash, dude. And this thing folds under pressure. 
Nice one. <laughs> nope. <laughs> My uh, N1 Plus portable two-in-one electric scarf warming and cooling. Okay, now I'm curious. Wait, what's a warming air conditioner? What do you mean? You condition the air, you can condition it hot or cold. Yeah. Really? That's conditioning it. You ever condition your hair? <laughs> By the looks of it, no. Uh-oh. <laughs> That's why he's balding. <laughs> Roasted, dude. We went a little hard in the paint there. Yeah, sorry. I take it. <laughs> what is this, Dawson's Creek? Oh, whoa. He's plugged into something. It's easy to take on the go. It just permanently looks like he has headphones on that he's not wearing. You have to plug it in? Oh, trash. Best way to cool down body temperature while doing outdoor activities. What is that? <laughs> oh my god! Oh gosh! Are you really about to stop mid run and be like, ah, oh, that's it? All right, let's just let's add this baby to cart. Maybe I will, Mike, and test it out. Add a cart. That was intense. Cool packaging. You can just hold that for me. All right. <sighs> this head's way too big. It's like a little chef now. Oh, it's yellow. We love a racing yellow. <laughs> it matches my Honda Civic. It does match the hoverboard we have. <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> if you hoverboard with this one, <laughs> I, I'm gonna push you over. <laughs> wow, what a bully, you know? Just can't let someone be. Oh, that's like hot metal. That's right, brother. Insulation or something. How do you turn it on? Oh, I have to plug it in. There's no battery on this. That's wow. what I was saying. What if this gets dog? so hot that it burns your neck and you just are branded? They just have their like brand name on the inside. <laughs> So we are, we're, we're lit up here. Your best friend at a party. We are lit up here. <laughs> we're gonna put it on cold. It's cold. Do you feel it? It's pretty quiet, I must say. It's cold. <laughs> Is it loud? What? Is it loud? No. Dad's kind of old sometimes, you know? <laughs> my ear, yeah, there's so much pressure in my head, you don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say this would be more futuristic if you didn't need that cable. Like, yeah. if it was just all within that and that was it. It's try, straight up hot. cold. No, try hot I'm gonna try hot, dude. It's it's warming up. Is it as hot as I don't know the chemistry in the room right now? Um, feeling hot? No, not, not, can't be. <laughs> I feel like this could work. It's really dumb looking and you have to walk around with a battery. But, you know, if you wanna, I mean, what's the use case though? Like, you forget your jacket, but you don't forget this? Like, what? I'm gonna say it's dope, it does its functions. It'd be a little bit better if you just didn't need the cord. I mean, it's pretty, like, that's a new modern day scarf. I'd say next product. Next product. All right, guys, so we got a futuristic looking vacuum tube speaker right here, as you can see. Let's watch this little video first. Aesthetic, all white, I like it. This is by Michael Badal. All right, so they changed different colors on the insides. I'm sure you can set it to one if you really want. I'm gonna have to, to say be. nope already. Only if you really want. <laughs> Only if you really want. You I'm gonna have to no say nope. Can. Why? Why? You'll see. What if these things, like, boom? Like, they put out some fire bangers. They don't. <laughs> All right, let, let's test them out. Out of cord. So it plugs in and then it hooks up to Bluetooth. More wires? Wow, look at this, right here. Fancy, bro, fancy. What the heck is that? Take this, yeah. Oh, I was like, what? <laughs> it does look like a telephone. <laughs> I didn't even hit anything, it just did it itself. I hope these prove you wrong, but they sound really good. Oh, it's touch. It sounds like the beginning of that 80s song where they're dancing. The first page of an empty notebook, like the first stage of my open playbook. That's pretty loud. I'm not gonna lie. Are you making fun of Con? Is this like, is this like a Lupe fiasco? These bang, bro. <laughs> I don't know about you, but that that was not good audio. So hold on, you've been only hearing treble, and that's put us in. So trouble. here's the thing: I mixed that track. It should sound a lot better than that. Every artist ever, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I mixed that Facts. track. No printer. Uh, Facts. That sounds worse. That sounds, that sounds worse. way worse. Facebook sounds way worse. Yeah. I mean, no, pump it. Pump it. This passion was something that's supposed to last you. That looks cool. Well, we're like a water park. <laughs> <laughs> this just got emotional. <laughs> yeah, it really got like dark and kind of like what wet at some dog? point. Dude, that was that's really- That's a happy-go-lucky uh, track. I mean, as easy as he's broke. Okay, you guys, that was still $200 now. That's not <laughs> you just poured water down the speaker, bro. <laughs> yeah, you already were pouring water down it, so I- But it, was it working still? No, it sucked. Legit sucked. I'm gonna say to no! Double whammy, next product. Guys, before we get to the next product, if there's one thing I know about life, it is that cringe is key. And that is who we are shouting out today because they are a member of our membership members. That's right, they hit the join button down below and they got access to a bunch of exclusive stuff like live streams, like extra emojis. What else? Um, they got access to extra BTS vlogs where they get to see how everything's made and you maybe lie. cool challenges. I'm selling you the truth, brother. You're selling me the I'm truth? I'm selling you what <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> now guys, take note from this person and understand that cringe is key. And if you 
want more cringe, hit that join button down below and check the three tiers because I promise you, if you're looking at me, I will provide it. All right, now, next product. And thank you, again, cringe is key. Did you know the future's here, Matthias? It was here, now it's the past. Guess what, AGS, what does that stand for? All good sugar. All good sugar. All, All good sugar. sugar. All good sugar. World's most advanced wireless laser projection, Bluetooth, virtual keyboard and mouse for iPhone, iPad, smartphone, and tablets. So ideally, this would be pretty cool. What do you mean ideally? Is it not cool, Michael? <laughs> well, like ideally, if this functions well, it will be sick, but if it functions uh, poorly, then it's obviously trash. Riddle me this. When you're typing, it's projecting it onto your fingers. Is that why it works? No. It doesn't stay under your fingers. So they should make one where it's a table and it projects under, so then you're on top of you it. You gotta no. bring around a table, dog. Well, I didn't say I was gonna make it. I said <laughs> they should make one. I bet you can't even see it in the light. Yeah, that looks like trash right there. It's for people with dim rooms, I'm assuming. Add to the scart. This is perfect for you because you're sick, so you don't have to touch anything physical. <laughs> you're just touching a light. <sighs> I hate that noise. Is it laggy? It just doesn't. What is the goal of this? It misses half the things. Is it convenience? I, I feel like I'm on a typewriter, it. like surrounded by monkeys. Here, let this monkey <laughs> give it a try. Wow. See, I type relatively quickly. As you can see, this is me right now. Holy moly, this is the worst thing I've ever experienced in my life. <laughs> you broke it, dog. Yeah, it stopped working, dude. And it's not even in Chinese. You out-typed it. Yeah. <laughs> you have to hit one key at a time, and if you don't do it like that, it's like, I'm just not even gonna do anything. All right, well, this thing sucks. Yeah, that's super finicky and janky. But how cool would the future be if it didn't? It's not made for the future, guys. Next product. Beach ah. dual breakfast sandwich maker timer silver. Guys, look at these eggs. Look how nasty that biscuit Something looks. Something doesn't add up here. Well, that biscuit's Well, it's fake. not math. Oh, they have a little pepper. Is that a, yeah, this looks good. So the whole goal here is that you can pretty much put everything on separate layers. Get it cooking, pull these puppies out, I'm imagining, and then boom. If that works, I'll eat my shorts. Hi, I'm Elise for Hamilton Beach. Hi, Elise. Hi. She looks like she's handcuffed to the table. <laughs> she's dripped in Christmas colors. She, <laughs> she looks like she's forced to be here. Just choose the bread you love, then layer on your favorite topping. Okay. Cheese. Lower the cooking plate and top ring, add an egg, top with the other piece of bread, and close. What? You put the on top that quick? Slide the egg cooking plates out, and you'll have two hot, toasty... Lies, I don't believe it. She doesn't have a soul. I don't trust her. Those muffins are not she nutritious. Well, Elise, we're gonna listen to you here. Elise. We're gonna add this to cart, and if you lied to us, I swear, Elise, you better watch out on Instagram. I'm gonna slide right into the comments. <laughs> Okay, so we grease this. We grease this puppy up. Let's do what she says. All right, so boom. First level. You're gonna put your first bun. Ready, team man? Follow bun. along. First bun done. Level. Oh wait, I need the the ham. Don't think this is the right cheese, but we're gonna go along with it. You look good. I know you like cheese a lot. I feel lot, like cheese Tanner. would be better. No, nope, this is a good spot for cheese, I guess. And then we're gonna close that. Boom. Here we go. I don't want you guys to know I'm an expert. And then according to Elise, you put the bun on it. That's what homegirl did. What in the psycho? That doesn't make That's sense. That's what she did. We all saw it. Oh, yep, and the yolk's leaking out the side here, kids. Yeah. A few moments later. All right. Ooh, spicy boy. My egg's definitely not cooked, bro. Oh, yikes, it's jiggling still. Okay, wait, let's just like take a... Oh, no, there's... Oh, Elise lied. No, you guys just didn't preheat. <laughs> oh, no. The preheat just went on. <laughs> oh, well, now what? I gotta reset this? We'll do a minute. All right, Michael, let's see how your egg turned out, dog. Oh, it's, it's stuck in there, dog. All right, it's cooked, it's cooked. So slide, slide that, that puppy. baby out. I mean, it cooked me an egg. It cooked, melted my cheese. My ham still looks a little questionable. That was but... questionable in the start, though. Here we go, three, two, one. <laughs> I thought I got you, I was like, yes, yeah, okay. <laughs> Come on, kids. Oh, delicioso. I mean, it's an egg. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the product works, it does its job. It is pretty efficient. We were just a little bit inefficient and in not letting it preheat at first. Yeah. But once that was done properly, then you set the timer. Yeah. It only took a minute for the egg to cook. So all in all, I'll say the product does work. Yeah. I'll say products are dope. Uh, our cooking skills are a no. Yeah. yeah. Thank you again to Oculus for sponsoring this video. If you guys want to see more information on Oculus and the Quest, check out the link down below and it'll take you there for all of the needs. Also, if you guys want to see more of our beautiful faces, go ahead and check out that video right there. That is 10 products that will help you prank your friends. Super Sigma, that iPhone was hilarious. Also, check out this video right here. That is one that YouTube recommends just for you. That's right, you bunch of silly billies. Click that if they're right, because YouTube's a little crazy and they know everything about you. So subscribe, hit that bell icon, tell your parents you love them, tell your kids you love them if you're parents, and we'll see you later. Peace. Oculus.